The Chantelable here with part 2 of my Dawn of War Dark Crusade Let's Play campaign as the Necrons. So we're currently like a few minutes into the battle to wipe out the Imperial Guard. I don't think it's a difficult mission, it's just one that we need to be... It's just a bit time consuming, that's all. But it's good. Hmm, I wonder if I could revive them. Eh, it doesn't matter. Okay, more. Just trying to see where the best place is to put these. Usually at, somewhere out of the way. It's not going to get attacked too easily. Uh, maybe if I put another summoning core down here, that'll increase my influence in this area here. Because as far as energy concerns, we're going to be fine. Like, these missions, if you can get past the beginning, you, you, they're easy. Because they don't expand their base at all. There's yeah, they just don't. Whereas in a normal sort of skirmish, you know, they start off in a spot and they continue to expand and their resources are just re critical mass and you just can't bloody crush them. Whereas this, it's just going to be constant waves of relatively medium-sized forces. So, pop four. What do we need for this? Greater summoning core. Okay. Happened here? Did we stop? Can we get multiple things working? No, you can't get multiple things working at the same time. Um, okay. Where's the thing that's used to like revive them? Resurrection orb. That's what we need. All in due time. So we got a good amount of energy coming through at the moment, which is good. Necron Lord is at full health, so he should just get into the fight. Even if he dies, he's so easy to revive. Send them on an attack vision, because like they're they're cheap units, so who cares if they get killed? Now we can make one more monolith. Oh but we don't have any energy. No matter the cost. What's this? Destroy first company's forward base. Okay, cool. Let's go do that. What if the lightning field will help against this? Oh yeah. Enough for another monolith. Let's build it over here.
I think we're starting to lose uh, units. Oh no, we're still good for divisions, so we're okay. This is why we need lots of power. So we don't ever want for power. Okay, one of my units got wiped out, I think. So does that mean another one got recruited? Yep, there it is. Okay, you're not doing anything. Go and capture this strategic point. Okay, first company's forward base has been destroyed. Tell the Vindicare Temple to eliminate their commander. One chance is all I need. Even if they snipe him, it just revives from death. So I need to send someone back over here to get rid of that. So now we can start getting some higher tier units. Let's see which which ones should we get? Good for destroying enemy vehicles and uh, buildings. That'd be good. So get heavy destroyer. Get an energy core down. Provides nearby Necron corpses, so I did, oh, well, you're about to become a Necron corpse. Attacking forces! This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed! Yeah, death doesn't really mean much to the uh, Necron, so we'll just revive him. Much better off going after buildings, apparently. No, oh, it's not that powerful. Still a lot of health, though. Yeah, I don't want you to capture the point, I want you to attack it. Yeah, we're pretty good for energy right now. What if we build a second one of these? It probably doesn't do anything, but... Fuck it, we got heaps of space. Pirate solution plotted! Now you will see what it means to face the Imperial Guard! Artillery! Open fire! Where are they bombing? Doesn't matter. Okay, so... 
you go and capture this point. Building a second one doesn't do anything. It's all good. We really don't need any more plasma generators, I think, but fuck it. I don't... I don't mind. More. they're finished with that. Versus. Busy. Come and uh, fortify this position. This thing's nearly destroyed, but I don't care. Make another one. Destroy the artillery batteries, no problem. Right, so what do we need? I feel like their DPS wasn't very good. Lord Destroyer can possess enemy vehicles. Hmm, alright, let's give him a shot. Because I haven't really been using their abilities so far, just because I've sort of been rushing. Like, I, need, I still need to learn how to play as the Necrons, know their strengths and weaknesses. Seems like their units are really tanky. Alright, so can we put one of these down? And I want you guys to just attack anything along this area. Lord Destroyer. What is this? Status field. Possess enemy vehicle. Third company. Hold the line. The Emperor demands it. He's only got half the hit points of the other thing. So just shoot through the wall or whatever. So they're not that good at dealing with the units. Forces. Let's try the two. This is Governor uh, Militant Lucas Alexander. Effective against. Your commander is dead. Oh, you died? You oh, cannot okay. win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. So Pariah is effective against infantry and heavy infantry. Each swipe of Pariah's war size allows the target, target's movement speed... Sorry. Slows the target's movement speed and lowers maximum health. This effect remains until the Pariah is eliminated. Oh, okay. And it seems to work against infantry. Fire control. Initiate strafing run. Oh, I should be trying to possess these vehicles. Which uh, right now. You guys get over here. Even if I lose the monolith, look at look at my energy content now. What does it matter? Attacking forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. We'll be fine. Give me a second one here to help defend it, just in case.
seemingly has him in a pretty bad spot right here, but I'll just keep reviving him, it doesn't cost much. Forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. Man, he does not last very long out there. Win. Win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. Yeah, let's get let's get these tomb spiders. Okay, there it is. What else can it do? I don't even know its capabilities. It can create attack scarabs at cost of its own health. What do they do? Awesome. Send it off to attack. Where's my thing? No, it's a Lord Destroyer. Where's the Scarab? Thing. Tomb Spider. No, wait, wait, wait. It's a Lord Destroyer. He can... Steal some of these, apparently. Curious to see how this works. Attacking forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down it's your arms or answer. be destroyed. Oh, but it gets rid of the uh, the Lord Destroyer. Okay. Yeah. Sergeant, get me control of those streets. How do we... By the Emperor, you will have it. There we go. So that's how you start getting the bodies. You need to make sure that it actually has that selected. Forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. So come over here. So he starts collecting bodies. Oh, I can only click the Necron bodies. Alright, and then from here, spawn more Necron warriors, flayed ones, or immortals. Is it possible that I can keep doing this even if I've used my cap? Oh, I totally can. Okay, so I officially love Tomb Spiders now. Oh, that's so OP. Attacking forces! This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. Whatever. 
ever just 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 keep throwing units at them. Oh, hang on, we got we got under attack over here. Um, I kind of need assistance then. Yeah, you guys go repair this. I can't make any more tomb spiders, but I could make some heavy destroyers. Yeah, I don't think this area... Oh, where is it? You can go and capture that. We have to be. Oh no, they're there. Oh. Attacking forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. Okay, I'm gonna put these guys in control group two. I don't necessarily want to put them in combat. Because although because you can't just build new ones, they have to be revived. creating more forces. Fire control. Initiate strafing run. Okay, maybe some gorse cannons out here could be useful. Where else have we suffered some casualties? So you can go in over here. Go, go pick up those bodies. Go destroy the buildings. Forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. Okay, bring it back. And once and once we've like clear this area, bring the tomb spiders in, just pick up all the huge numbers of corpses that we've left behind here to make even more immortals. The next one always, whichever, doesn't matter. Okay, Squad cannot be spawned because his squad cap has been reached. All right, fair enough. Look out! Here they come! Second mechanized company. The enemy is at your doorstep. Push them back, damn it! Destroy the second mechanized company's base. Get us down there. Do that. I'll come over here. 
heaps to revive. I wonder if they will even be revived because push back the front line, man. We won't let you down, son. So over my limit. Yeah, no, it's not gonna revive them. I gotta admit, the Necron are pretty fun to play. Fire control! Initiate strafing run! They play so differently to all the other races. What's this? Oh yeah, send him in. Uh let's see. Where is my these guys go and claim that. God, they pretty much store like an unlimited number of bodies. Right. Okay, I need to clear off um, this base down here first, I think. Plasma generator has completely decayed. Ah, so they decay over time. Alright. I mean, that's not good, but it's... It's okay. Let's just build more then. go over here, there'll be so many corpses to pick up, they'll have enough to fuel our needs for, for ages. How about you? Come and let's fortify this position here. Attacking forces! Okay, let's go this is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. Death doesn't stop the necklace. Just keep getting more of them, it doesn't matter. Of course, that artillery base is good. Man, this Bane Blade is strong. Just, just keep throwing troops at it eventually, guys. I need more vehicles. Fire control! Initiate strafing run! Bring you back over this way because I'd like to revive all these Necrons over here. I haven't researched this here, because that'll help us out a lot.
Got to finish off with this here first. Yeah, I suppose you can stay out here. Wait, wait, where's the, um, where's the objectives? The artillery batteries are over here. That's what's probably causing us the most cash, because get over there and kill them. So we're going to get him into another one of the situations where it's just going to have to revive him a ton of times. But take care of the Basilisks, this is where we're really going to have to work. Forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. Oh, hang on. There's the immortals. I was thinking to myself that I couldn't recruit more immortals. So these elite warriors were first to swear allegiance to the Catan. Uh, equipped with Gorse Blaster, they are calibrated to penetrate vehicle and building armor, only effective against infantry in melee combat. Ah, oh, so you want like a mix. Okay. It's all good. Look at this damn brain blade. At least it's not repairing. Got destroyed again. Just keeps in wave after wave after one okay. Look, look how much energy I got. What is it that? Him constantly being stunned is good. Once we get rid of this, it'll be a lot easier. This is just Taking so much of that stuff. Oh, Doesn't look like he can be stunned, so that's good. Take this out because it's giving me the shit. I think he's stuck. I can't move past this. Alright, well then just keep the damage whatever you can. So how do we go against the Bane Blade? Well, it's almost dead, but it didn't do a whole lot this time. I reckon once we've done, gotten past this, the rest of this will be pretty quick. Surely you can move past this. Oh. 
Like, you know, get rid of the things that are causing stun. That's really, really, um, slowing us down. Destroy that fucking bane blade. Attacking forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. I wouldn't even worry about that. We gotta get rid of this damn bane blade. Get rid of this base with such some units. Send a platoon to secure that location. Executing your orders, sir! I wonder if I could have used the Lord Destroyer to actually possess it. That would have been hilarious. It's too late now. Probably end up destroying it this time. Because the destroyer managed to get to them without being distracted. Troops are going to come from here. And it looks like our Necron Lord has, for the most part, cleared off. Taking out those um, artillery really helps speed things up. Maybe a... Second company's fire control system. Our air support is gone. Yeah, we're not quite done yet. Should be the rest of this, but okay, we should be able to cross over here as well. Get out there, other artillery. Although it's up here. You two, three, sorry. You should be safe to come around over here and start picking up some bodies. Try and rebuild here, do they? Oh, I see what they're trying to do. No, we can't let them do that. They want to re rebuild on this post. Can't let that happen. I'll take it for myself. See, so they've already fortified that position. Up to 
find this spot. What's this? Oh, increased time, right, I see. Okay, well, that's going on. Come over here, make the attack on the other side of the river. So they got killed, but that's okay. Liberators! The enemy has made it to the northern shore. Redeploy to drive them back. Damn it, you can rest when you're dead. Well, well, you know what I mean. With every barracks of theirs that we destroy, we reduce the rate at which they will build the food. Obviously. Which means the, the fewer waves that we have to deal with, and the sooner we'll just be able to stomp them. Oh, okay. Take this first. It may not be able to be taken. Just, just yet, I mean. Oh man, lots of bloody mines here. Ah, who cares. It's all good. Get blown up. Okay, so the artillery batteries have been... Oh, okay, there we go. I was going to say, why haven't it got the mission done? We could have crossed over this way. But it's fine, we'll just keep going in this direction. Attacking forces! This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You He's cannot basically just win. letting me know to reply. Lay down it. your arms or be destroyed! Scarab. Or if I lost them all. Yeah. Lost three units. But that's okay, they don't cost anything. There's still bodies out here to collect, or are you just completely full? How do you tell where how many bodies they've Push got? Push back the front line, men. We won't let you down, sir. So we've got most of this under control for the time being. What about over here? Could fix that up.
don't think it really matters about like lowering their requisition rate because I'm pretty sure they get like pretty much unlimited. Yeah, taking out those barracks, that's what it's all about. Ah, uh, then there's this cannon thing, right. So what we need to do is just cross over here, and I think this is its energy core here. That takes it out. Puts it under our control. Well, I'd just rather destroy it. I don't need it. Because this here is blocked off. Okay, that's fine. That, that base is cleared. Good, let's move on. God damn, you always get out of these battles. Attacking like, forces. You did. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Go, go, go! On my command, fire the Titan cannon. Fire! Why'd you kill your own troops? Begin recharge! I want that gun firing again! I mean, yeah, if you're gonna kill your own troops to kill some of mine, that makes sense, but... I need you over there to help revive. There's going to be a lot of casualties here. I need you to revive them. And have I upgraded these troops enough yet? I wonder if I build a. Oh, okay, we've maxed out. Let's go to something. Um, vehicle limit, I mean. Commissar, come in! We have purged your good lick, Governor. Who will be next? Damn you, monster! Oh, these guys are allies. Well, whatever. Let's go and kill them. Take control of the, um... The Titan Cannon. The Titan Cannon power grid is under attack. Redirect fire to protect it and initiate repairs. I will ease the machine's pain. Just keep it online, tech priest. Good, they'll just keep producing more units and put the pressure on them. We can put energy things on the stag deposits. Attack! Protect those generators, men. Time for payback! Generators, men. Spend the entire episode just doing this this mission, but we'll we'll get it done within the next forty minutes. Like I said, after you get past here, it's just been a slaughter. Now, resources are all under control. We're good to go. Twenty-two thousand. Protect those generators, men.
protect those generators, men. Infantry, I think. Yeah, we've got new ones being created here. Time to send them. To the I am under attack. Protect those generators, men. Time for payback. Build, no, no, wrong thing. I am under attack! Protect those generators, men. But the Emperor is still with us. Give them hell, men! Okay, so yep, no more energy grid for you, and we'll make use of this. So I take control of the time cannon, but all that means is that it fires on our mark, and I don't even want it shooting at all. I think, I kind of remember that, to be honest. Build the scarabs. There's loads of corpses over here for them to uh, go and collect. Let's make our way through the trench here and come up this way right behind them instead of going through this shitstorm over here. I don't think I really need to bother too much about whatever base might be here. We just need to get up here and, and finish this. Time for payback. With that, we can bring one of the monoliths online. But like I said, I don't really care about doing that right now. Along with our allies, we should be able to push push up to here. Oh, another one of these. That one. Our destroyer should be able to handle it. Send them straight to the front line. Okay, looks like that tank is gone. Hold the line, men! 
Push these metal monsters back to the hell they crawled out of! So much fear. So much noise. So we can't leave these guys behind us. As soon as, as soon as they're dead, the allies can help us out over here as well. Or maybe I should just let them handle it. Oh, they're taking the shortcut. Uh, I don't really care. Do they get there with like no health left? My lord, the enemy is building generators to feed power to the Titan cannon. This will allow them to fire the great gun. Damnation! Attention, all troops! The enemy has control of the Titan gun. Use extreme caution when passing through the trench. Need you to help us with the, uh, the enemy tanks. I'm sure there's more to collect over here. I need him to revive one of these guys. They died. Get the tanks. What are they doing? Come and help me. That's okay, he's giving me the busy so he can destroy all this stuff. Uh, what happened to my Builder Scarabs? Attacking forces! This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms, or be destroyed! Won't be long to his back. See, like the Necron warriors that I'm recruiting, they're going through this gauntlet area. You know what I might do? I might restore this monolith. their buildings and the tanks. They're the things that are causing me the most problems. The infantry is just soaking up damage. That's all they're doing. Look, 
quicker to move this way. Probably only oh wait, yeah, I can only restore one at a time. Gotta revive some more. So if I was to click on the Titan Cannon, where is it? I don't know how to make a fire, but I don't really care right now. Attacking forces! This is Governor Militant Lucas Didn't Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms things are there. Pick or up. be destroyed! Oh, doing it. Why'd they stop? Oh, that's right, I was going to... got to revive him. It doesn't seem like my allies are going to help me through the rest of this. And they've built up a sizable force now, so I'm, like, sending in wave after wave just isn't really working. Where's my monolith? Possibly because we can't see where we're going. Oh no. So I need to raise a sizable force before I go back in there. Just keep destroying all their buildings so they're, they're having the trouble to rebuild them, I think. Get up here, destroy the buildings. And the tanks. Although they can keep rebuilding the tanks. If it gets destroyed, I'll build one closer to the front line. Attacking forces! This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms, or be destroyed! Alright, cool, we got a bunch of new troops over here. Send them to fight. Good, the, the monolith here is basically clearing all the shit out, but it's really slow. Forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. I don't even your really need to take right now. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. Let's put him in the queue. 
He'll come back eventually. He's still got three quarters of your health. But yeah, clear it all this shit because it's producing units for it. And while that's going on, these guys will come up over here and uh, smash their, their copper base. Got another bloody bane blade. Fuck it. Okay, get back. It's quick. You can move it here. Looks like I can just teleport. So I can should be able to revive a ton of them. Okay. Seems to do quite well taking out Billy. Yeah, take out that damn bang blade. Oh, this thing's really good taking out vehicles. Good. Yeah, and just kill everything. That's in half health now. That's like it's not a big deal to build another one. Gets destroyed. I think now we can justify putting these guys up on the front line. Just one big push. Even the allies are coming to help now. Big push to finish this off. Yeah, I think it's gone. So right, I just like I said, just build another one as soon as this is done. Limit three. If they get destroyed, you can't rebuild it. Well, that's cheeky. I'm not. I'm not bringing any more of them online. It's okay. It helped me clear out that lower base area there. That's good enough. Oh, what the fuck! It revives itself. That's why I couldn't build another one. It's still here. How do you like that? Tell you what they've got. Lots of defenses up this way. Just gonna put the pressure on them somehow. Oh shit, where'd those scarabs go? Yeah. No, no, you're supposed to um, go repair this. Because I want to uh, put it back online again.
the objective now. Destroy the Governor Militant's main base. Take control of the Titan. Yeah, we don't we don't need to do that. But fuck it, let's do it anyway. Oh shit. Come on, stop sitting around. Gotta finish this before the hour and a half mark. Could be preferable. Could be gonna kill. We've got these guys in here. Attacking forces. This is Governor Militant Lucas Alexander. Your commander is dead. You cannot win. Lay down your arms or be destroyed. They built. I think this is the main thing that we need to build uh, destroy here. If we destroy this, it's over. Yeah, prioritize that. Back much longer. We can't allow the Titan cannon to fall into their hands. Overload the core. Oh, the Emperor. had faced Necrons before, notably on Lorn V and Verdus Prime, and it had cost the champions of man dearly each time. On Cronus, things only got harder, and when the Necron forces swept into Victory Bay, even the raw power of the revived Hellstorm cannon could not stop them. The Necrons showed cold contempt for the works of man as they murdered the last tech priests and guardsmen in Victory Bay. With none left to fear them and none left to die, they simply moved on to the next conquest. The remains of the great Titan gun, they ignored altogether. Even its mighty power, paling in comparison to the galactic genocide their gods demanded. So there we defeat. Do I not get some gear for that? Apparently not. Okay, well this is well protected. Who should we go and take on next? I mean, the Imperial Guard actually still exists over here. But where should we go? Who should we take on next? There's still one, two, three, four, five races left to wipe out. Well, let's, um, about chaos. Yeah, from here we can move on to there, and then to here. I don't know, I'd, I'd like to get a bit stronger first. So, what do we get from here? Crypt Pariah Squads. Because I didn't use the, um, the other 
decrypt immortals much. Didn't need them for the final push. Um, could make my way back over here. There's a lot. Of, look, I'll, I'll come over here, and we'll just finish off the um, the guys once and for all. The Imperial Guard. Should be relatively quick doing this. Of course, the problem is we gotta find the fuckers. to be good. you to go and capture this point. It doesn't look like they're over here. If I had to guess I'd say they're there, but it's, it's hard to tell. Teleport to get there a bit faster, that would be good. Let's use it again. So basically, I don't really care about building up the base too much, I just want to go and wipe them out. Must be over here. Literally the last place I looked. Should just be able to do this with the basic units. Yeah, see, their base was only ranked as tier 2, so it's really weak. area again, we want to make sure that uh, we've at least got a resource for them to control. Don't necessarily need to build my base up too much. Yeah, 
For the command center and it's all over. So maybe I don't need these anymore. Just get that done. Took him long enough to get here, but he was finished him off. How about you kill them? Because you don't do much damage in the buildings. I think you guys do a little bit more. about half health. We've obviously we've won. It's just a matter of getting on and getting it done. It's a good spot I reckon for for uh, plasma generators. That was easy. And we've got some war gear and Crypt Warrior Squad earned. That's good. Alright, so what do we really need? What does he need? So Heart of Darkness increases health regeneration. Probably don't worry, worry about that, because he just, just revived him straight from death. Reinforced body, reduce melee damage. Reduce damage from melee, I mean, uh, and greatly increase health. Should we kill next? So there's this here. This gives says imperial production requires control of the okay gain control of massive imperial factories allows you to supply your troops on the ground more easily. Start every mission with a thousand additional power. Good. Or you get a spaceport here. Gain control of sophisticated navigation system allowing long range flights to avoid anti aircraft fire. Allows attacking almost any province on the map regardless of adjacency. Cannot be used to attack strongholds, which are heavy anti-aircraft. Oh, okay. That can be useful. So basically from there you can attack anywhere. If we attack this, we could then make our attack on the Space Marine capital. But I'd rather get a little bit stronger first. But... Yeah, I'm still just going to do this. It's only on normal difficulty, so we can certainly handle taking on another 
Once a thriving it. industrial center, by the beginning of the dark. So once again, we just, just rush them. We just gotta find where they are. I don't think I've built as many scarabs this time. Gotta get your energy up right away. As the Necron Lawn gets more and more powerful, it'll be a lot easier to um, to sort of like rush the enemy. This is a very small map by the looks of it, so it should be pretty easy to find them. You don't want them to get set up. Then again, I'm the one that needs to get set up. Okay, we have found them. Can't be too far away from this. Keep sending people over there to essentially go and die. Or like I build up their infrastructure over here. And he's a hell of a lot more tanky now, so that's what it helps. If we want to beat them, we've got to take out their, their uh, buildings. Otherwise, they'll just keep producing more troops. Let's not drag this one out longer than it needs to. Go take out the, uh, the command center.
Can we destroy the command center? Shouldn't that be over? Was... They must have another one. I thought it was over there, so I stopped doing stuff. Oh well. There's probably another one down here then. But for the most part, we've got this. I mean, we've got loads of troops. In archive. Should have enough energy now to start upgrading these units. Yeah, you better run, bitch. And their main base must be down here. That's not important. As far as my squad cap is concerned, I've barely used any of them. Could keep producing more units. I'm fine with just using the, the free ones for the time being, just because I want to keep spending most of my money or my energy on building up the base, just in case this place ever gets attacked. And we we've already crushed them. Half of their forces can already be dead, and it did nothing to us. And it's not like these Necron warriors aren't good. They're actually very good. You gotta get rid of all the servitors. Oh, okay, well, we'll do that then. I thought they would have had a second base, but nope. Alright, cool. We're at an hour and 36 minutes, so this is a good opportunity to end the episode here. So, guys, like and subscribe. Part 3 is next, and don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.